Just watch them, and especially in slow motion, you can see how attentive they are. Cranes know exactly where every wing feather is, and you might get 10,000 birds in one flock, they never touch wings with one another. They're wonderful gliders. They can just adjust the wings and tail and do these wonderful aeronautics. I think of it as a kind of dance of life when they're up in the air and circling around. I think they must be thinking, my God, it feels good to be back in the plant. It just makes me think they, they must be overjoyed. Copy that, we've got eyes on you. stressed, I think. So in the prairie dog mind, I can either work or I can die. And I think that that's where their strong work ethic comes from. They are masters of the dirt. They can build and excavate some of the soils that you don't understand how they're surviving in it. They know how to build tunnels and just about anything. The rate of biodiversity is so much higher on a prairie dog colony than off. Reintroducing prairie dogs to a collapsed ecosystem can cause the ecosystem to build back up. As the prairie dogs start burrowing, they start promoting the growth of different kinds of vegetation. Other animals come in using the burrows, preying on the prairie dogs, eating the vegetation that the prairie dogs are causing to re-sprout. Over time, you start rebuilding the ecosystem that you once had. They're an amazing creature that just really does good things for the environment. That's a species that should be protected. 